Good morning, everyone, and welcome to Wonder of the Seas. Oh my goodness, this ship is incredible. Absolutely incredible. And I bet you would like to see it from top to bottom, right? So that's what we're gonna do today. We are gonna explore everything this ship has to offer. There are 18 total decks. We're gonna start at the top and we're gonna work our way all the way to the bottom. We're gonna check out every venue, every restaurant, and everything in between. It's gonna be really fun, so let's get going. I cannot wait to see it all. Let's go. We are starting our tour today on deck 18 because it is the top deck. And on deck 18 and deck 17, you will find the sweet deck. Now, I do not have a Sweet. But if you do, you will be here probably most of your time. Here you will find Coastal Kitchen. There is a Sweet Sun Deck, which is also new for Royal Caribbean on Wonder of the Seas. Come check this out. It's beautiful. I feel like I'm in a whole different area of the ship. It doesn't even feel like the same ship that I boarded at the beginning of the day yesterday. We are now on deck 16 at the front of the ship, and here you will find the specialty restaurant called Hooked. If you love seafood, you do not want to miss this restaurant. The menu looks fantastic. We have reservations to eat here later in the week and I cannot wait. It looks amazing. Come check it out. Plus look at this view. It is absolutely beautiful in here. You have this entire view of the ocean. What more could you want? We just stepped outside of where Hooked was. We are still on deck 16 and here you will find a lime and coconut bar. I love this area. It's so nice. It's a great place to come and chill and enjoy all of this air and you too could have hair like me. <laughs> It's the best. I love ship hair. It makes me feel like I'm truly on vacation. You need to come up here and enjoy. Amongst all of the seating on deck 16, you'll also find these casitas, which are available for rent. So come over here, check them out. It'd be a great way to have your own little private oasis on your Oasis class ship. Another thing I love on deck 16 are these plunge whirlpools. And I love them because you don't have to go all the way to the pool deck to get in the water. If you're enjoying the sun and you just want to get a little cool off, jump in, then get back to sunning yourself and enjoy your sea day. All right, if you can see behind me all of these flashing lights, that could only mean one thing. We're in the arcade. And this arcade looks so fun. So many games, you gotta come over here and try it. We are still on deck 16. Come over here and play everything, everything. I wanna play everything. Maybe I will play everything. We are moving towards the back of deck 16. And before we get to the back, you will find El Loco Fresh. This is going to be a complimentary Mexican dining option on board. They have lunch here. You've gotta come try it. The food is so good here. Come enjoy it. You know, why not? Enjoy it all. Right behind El Loco Fresh, you will find Cantina Fresca. Talk about margaritas, holy moly. Come over here, every flavor, I'm loving it. I am gonna have to stop in here because I want one of everything. Okay, we are continuing on deck 16 and we're getting closer and closer to the back. And here you will find the Wonder Dunes. You know what this is, this is mini golf. You can come over here, grab yourself a putter, grab yourself a ball and try to get your hole in one. Directly across from El Loco Fresh in the Wonder Dunes, you will find the basketball court and you will find ping pong. So come over here, grab a ball, shoot a couple hoops, hit a couple balls and ping pong. I don't know what you do, but have fun. Have you ever wanted to try zip lining? Of course you have. Why not try it over the boardwalk? Why not? What? We have made it to the back of deck 16. And this is huge. This is Flow Rider. You know what to do. This is the surfing simulator on board. This is so much fun. Look at that. So much fun. Okay, we are still at the back of deck 16. And with all this crazy adventure stuff, you may need a little bit of liquid courage, right? If you do, stop by the Wipeout Bar. They will take care of your needs and get you on the Flow Rider and get you down the Ultimate Abyss. And I think we've saved the best for last. We are standing in front of the Ultimate Abyss. The ultimate abyss is that big purple slide that you see at the back of the ship. It goes from deck 16 all the way to deck eight. That's a lot of decks, but it would be the fastest way to get there. So you gotta come check it out. I mean, it's faster than the elevators, right? We are now on deck 15. And deck 15 is gonna be the start of all of your fun stuff. But before we get to all the crazy adventurous stuff, let's talk about where I am right now. On deck 15 at the front of the ship, you will find the solarium. The solarium is going to be your adult only pool area on board. And it is the calm of the calm, the peaceful of the peace. It is amazing in here. Come in here, grab a chair. There's a bar here, grab a cocktail, go in the hot tubs, enjoy it all and just relax. And take a look at this roof. 
It's all climate controlled in here. I love this area. Oh, I wish I could stay here. I'm gonna be back to this area because it's so beautiful, but there's so much more to see. Deck 15 is crazy. While you're enjoying all of the calm in the solarium, don't miss out on the Solarium Bistro. This is a complimentary dining option on board. They have breakfast and lunch and dinner. Come over here, it's like fresh, it's really great. Right outside the Solarium, you will find the View Bar. This is a new area on board Wonder of the Seas and I love this for an Oasis class ship. You can come over here, grab a cocktail, listen to the ocean. It's such a great environment, I love this bar. We are outside now on deck 15, and this is going to be the start of all the fun on Wonder of the Seas. So first, you have these amazing water slides. There are three of them. One is like, it goes into a toilet bowl. The other ones are like fast slides. Come check those out. They look incredible. And then, it doesn't stop there. You've got these pool areas. First, you have this kid's pool area. This is like the best splash park ever at sea. Look at all this fun stuff. I wish I could jump in there and play. So many things to do, I love that. And then on the other side, you will find this amazing pool. I love how this is laid out. It's so beautiful and relaxing and the perfect way to spend a sea day. Right between the two pools, you will find Sprinkles. Sprinkles is going to be your complimentary ice cream on board. Chocolate, vanilla, strawberry, whatever you like, come over here, grab a cone. Right past that first set of pools, you will find the lime and coconut bar. This is gonna be your pool bar, but it's so much more than a pool bar. You can come over here, grab a great cocktail. There's lots of great seating. It's super relaxing. It's covered. It's beautiful. Come over here and enjoy. So we are moving right along on deck 15, and here you will find the second set of pools. I love these pools. I especially love the loungers in the water. Look at how relaxing this is. Plus, look at these padded lounge chairs like this is not a sweet area this is open to everyone how amazing is that so comfy i love that i love this stadium seating so you can just kind of relax watch a movie i love this area they did such a great job this is definitely an upgrade it's so beautiful and relaxing i mean the best way to just enjoy your sea day all right, we are coming to the back of deck 15. And before we get to the buffet, which I can smell, it's making me so hungry, I wanna talk about this new restaurant on board Wonder of the Seas. This is a specialty restaurant called Mason Jar. The menu is stunning, I love it. There's a bar here. They have all different kinds of cocktails and specialty drinks. Come check this out, I love the atmosphere. There can even be a live band here. This is the coolest venue. This is like down home fun on a ship. I love that. You gotta come check out Mason Jar. We are moving right along on deck 15. There's a lot of stuff on deck 15, but this is one thing that you will not want to miss. This is the wind jammer. This is the complimentary buffet on board, breakfast, lunch, dinner, and grab some snacks in between. This buffet is beautiful. I love the layout. So many choices. Come over here, grab something to eat and enjoy. We are now on deck 14 and we are at the front of the ship and here you will find the Adventure Ocean Kids Club. And when I tell you, OMG, this club is amazing, it is beyond amazing. I kind of wish I was a kid because this is really, really cool. Let's start with the babies, which is six to 36 months. Check out this area. So when I get down here and play and read books, just look at all of this stuff. Plus they have cribs. They will take care of all the little ones needs. Then we move up to juniors, which is ages three to five. And check this out. There's a pirate ship, a pirate ship and a rocket and everything else to keep your kids entertained. There's also this play place. So there's like a climbing thing that kids can get in there and play and just have a good time, release all of that energy. And then there's AO Kids, which is ages six to 12. And check out this area. You first have a science area where they do experiments and do all kinds of things. Then you have an art area where there's an easels and painting and crayons. Just explore your creativity. They also have a kid's library. So for all your readers out there, you have all of these choices. I love that. And then check this out. These are interactive games where they project games on the wall. Your kids can interact with them and play. And then keep on moving around the corner. There's Nintendo Switches. There's a movie area where you can have a movie playing all the time. Little beanbag chairs, little relaxation. 
kitchen areas, and then they have a theater where they have performances, which is the coolest area. I wanna be a kid, I wanna do this, I wanna be in this area. This is probably the coolest kids club that I've ever seen at sea. We are now on deck 10, and deck 10 has mostly cabins on it, but there is one thing that you have to come check out if you are on Wonder of the Seas, and that is Wonderland. Wonderland is this imaginative journey into this world of cuisine. You just have to try it to know what it's like. Come over here, check it out. The Mad Hatter will welcome you into this amazing restaurant. I did this on Odyssey, done it on Symphony, done it on Harmony. You gotta try it. Now, we are still on a ship. I know these trees may confuse you, but we are still on a ship. We are about to go through Central Park. There are trees, it's lush, it's beautiful. Let's go walk around and check out what's on this deck. This is on deck eight. The first thing you will find here in Central Park is Chops Grill. This is the steakhouse on board. Love Chops Grill, the best steak you would find at sea. So good, come over here, check it out. And this is Chops Grill. Check out all of this. It's like outside seating, but not really outside seating. It's like you can dine al fresco, which is beautiful. The wind, come over here and check it out. Right next to Chops Grill, you will find the other entrance to the Rising Tide Bar. Come on here, grab a ride, grab a cocktail, and enjoy. Right across from Chops Grill, you will find 150 Central Park. This restaurant is, it's hard to explain. It's, it's pure, <laughs> it's pure chef's kiss. That's all it is. It's so good. Definitely recommend this restaurant. It is our favorite on board. We tried 150 Central Park on Symphony and loved it. Was blown away by the food quality. Come over here, enjoy, grab a glass of wine, and just relax. Moving right along through Central Park, you will find the Trellis Bar. I love this bar. At night, when it's all dark and beautiful and they have music playing, you grab a glass of wine and sit in Central Park. You really don't feel like you're on a ship. Come over here and check it out and enjoy. Right past the Trellis Bar, you will find the Park Cafe. This is a complimentary dining option on board Wonder of the Seas. You can come over here and grab salads. They have fruit. They have the most amazing sandwich that I had on day one. This is a really great place to come on embarkation day so your first day on the ship it's very quiet it's not as crazy as the buffet come over here check it out and you get to sit in central park it's beautiful we are making our way through central park and here finishing off all the yums of central park you will find giovanni's italian kitchen this is your italian restaurant on board pizza spaghetti everything Italian. Come over here, get it. I love Italian and this is such a great restaurant. Finishing off our Central Park tour, you will find these high-end shops. You can come over here, grab your jewelry, check it out. Why not? Enjoy. Treat yourself. We are now at the back of the ship and here you will find the Music Hall. This is an amazing venue. It's a small entertainment venue. Come over, they have live music, they have karaoke. Come check this out. I love this venue. We are now on deck six and we are at the front of the ship and here you will find the Vitality at Sea Spa and Fitness Center. Check out this fitness center. It is huge. Look at all of these machines, so many. And I really like that there is an entrance to the jogging track right here from inside the fitness center. That's really, really cool. I love that. And then let's go into the relaxing side, the spa side. Check out this. You can get your hair done. Look at the salon. You can get a pedicure, you can get a manicure, and then you can go relax and have a massage. And check out the thermal suite here. Look at these beds. They're so nice and warm and comfy. They also have tropical rainforest showers, your steam room, your sauna room. They have all of this to keep you relaxed on your vacation. Come check it out. So we started deck six at the spa, which is at the front of the ship, and it's an amazing, amazing area. Definitely don't miss that. But now we had to walk through the Royal Promenade and go up some stairs, and now we're back on deck six. And here you will find the start of a pretty amazing thing. Before we get to that pretty amazing thing, let me talk about these other amazing things. The first thing you will find here is the schooner bar. I love the schooner bar on Royal Caribbean ships. It feels so nautical. I love the theming. Come over here, grab a cocktail, and just enjoy. They also have trivia and stuff here. I love, just love this space. I also love that it looks down the Royal Promenade, so you have a great people watching view. Come over here and enjoy. Right across from the schooner bar, you see all these iPads? You know what that means. That means it's shore excursion time. You will find more shore excursion iPads up here on deck six. Come over here, 
book all of your fun things to do in port. I cannot stress it enough. There are so many cool things to do. Come check them out and have the best time. Right past the shore excursion desk, you will find the photo gallery. Come over here and check out all of your pictures that the amazing Royal Caribbean photographers take of you on your vacation. Okay, we've made it to the back of deck six. And this is, well, this may be my favorite. There are a lot of favorites on this ship, but I absolutely love this space. This is the boardwalk. There's so much to do out here. I cannot wait to show you through those doors is like, all the fun. Starting off our boardwalk fun, which is all the fun, right? When you go to the boardwalk, it's all about fun. And the first thing you'll find here is the dog house. This is going to be a complimentary hot dog stand for you. Grab a hot dog and enjoy all the fun activities on the boardwalk. Now, right past the boardwalk dog house, you can't have a boardwalk without a carousel. I did say carousel. There is a carousel on this ship. And this carousel is amazing. It's complimentary. Come and spin around as many times as you want. Why not? You can actually say you rode a carousel on a ship in the ocean. That's some pretty cool bragging rights. So now you've been at the Boardwalk Dog House. You've been on the carousel. Now you need some sugar, right? <laughs> Come over here to Sugar Beach. Grab all of the candy. And I do mean all of the candy. It's like all the candy. I love it. This is like my, my favorite store. I can take all the other stores and just keep the candy. We're still on deck six. We're still in the boardwalk area. And I didn't even know this existed. This is the kids shop, which means this is the kids swag shop. So your Royal Caribbean plushies, special shirts for the kids, your toys, all of that stuff you can find here. This is really, really neat. I had no idea this was here. Right across from the kids shop, you will find Playmakers. This is going to be your sports bar on board. We love Playmakers. And if you've noticed, you might've noticed at the end of every cruise on the very last night, we come over here and have wings and onion rings. I love it. Come over here, watch all your sports. They have all of the TVs, grab some wings, grab a beer and enjoy. Now, we already had our hot dogs. What goes better with hot dogs than a hamburger? You're on the boardwalk, why not? This is Johnny Rockets. Come over here, grab your burger, grab your shake, grab your fries, grab it all and enjoy. Do you remember when I told you about the abyss on deck 16 where the entrance was? Well, this is where the exit is on deck six on the boardwalk. 16 to six. I'm not real good at math, but that's a lot of decks. <laughs> You gotta come try the abyss, it's so fun. There's lights, and it's just fun, come try it. We are moving right along on deck six and we're almost to the end, almost. But you won't miss this because it is huge. It's so big. This is the rock climbing wall. You can climb this. Sean did this on Harmony, he loved it. It's really crazy. I, I'm not even, I wouldn't even try to do this. If this is something that you would love to do, come over here, don't miss it. It looks huge, I don't know, it scares me. <laughs> We have made it to the back of deck six now at the back and you cannot miss this because we are now standing at the aqua theater and the aqua theater is an aqua theater. It's a pool where they have shows, they do diving. It's really, really neat. Do not miss this. Seriously, it's one show that you do not want to miss. It's at the back on the boardwalk on deck six. We are now on deck five and we are at the back of the ship and here you will find an entrance to the main dining room. Now remember main dining room is where you're going to have breakfast, lunch and dinner and it is complimentary. Come over here, check out the menu. They have a menu on the wall. I love that. The room is beautiful. Come over here and eat everything, eat it all. Right past the main dining room, you will find the entrance to the Royal Promenade. This is an amazing open area with restaurants and bars and just everything. Let's go check it out. And the first thing you will find here on the Royal Promenade is your shore excursion desks. Well, they're now iPads. So you can come over here, explore all of the options at all of the ports. There's so many different things to do. There's zip lining and there's coasters and there's just so much. You could not be bored on any of your excursions. So come check them out, see what they had to offer. Right past the shore excursion iPads, you will find the bionic bar. What is the bionic bar you ask? Well, these are robots. Robots will make you a drink. And they also have mocktails on here too. So come check it out. Let a robot make you drink. Why not? You're at sea, enjoy. It's a robot. It's a robot, like a real robot. <laughs> Right past the Bionic Bar, you will find an entrance to the Rising Tide Bar. This bar actually goes up and down. It's really, really cool. There are two entrances. There's one here on Deck 5, and there's one on Deck 8, which is in Central Park. Very cool. There's also a little time here to check for when it leaves, so check that out. 
come and enjoy the ride, get a drink. I mean, why not? Right next to the Rising Tide Bar, you will find guest services. Here's where you can come and let them help you out with anything that you need. Whatever it may be, come over here. Super easy. I love how everything's in one location on deck five. It's really like a one-stop shop. Right next to guest services, you will find the Cafe Promenade. This is like a really nice, chill, relaxing place. You can grab a cup of coffee. You can grab a sandwich. You can also get some specialty coffee here as well, like lattes and cappuccinos. Come over here and relax and enjoy. We are moving right along on deck five, and here you will find the next cruise desk. Here you can come book all of your future cruises because once you book one, you're gonna to wanna to book another and another and another and another and another. Come over and let them help you out. Sometimes you can even get some really good deals, so come check them out at Next Cruise on Deck 5. Right past the Cafe Promenade, you will find a place called Accessory Place. Here you can find your Swarovski crystals, your jewelry. Come over here, and enjoy. Why not? You're on a cruise. We're moving right along on deck five. We're actually about halfway. That's how big this deck is. And here you will find the cask and clipper. This is going to be your pub on board. Come over here, grab a pint, enjoy some of the live music. It's a great place to just hang out. And you know what will go really great with that pint? A slice of pizza. You can come over here and grab a slice of pizza at Sorrento's. They also have like some antipasta and some other things. Check it out. This is also complimentary, so why not? Right past the cask and clipper and Sorrento's, you will find the Port Merchant Shop. This is going to be where you'll find your duty-free stuff, so your liquors, they have some snacks in here. Come check it out and enjoy. Moving right along, we are now to the shop. The shop is going to be where you will find all of your Royal Caribbean swag, your sweatshirts, your t-shirts, your mugs, your ornaments, your magnets. Now, I always like to recommend that if you are really wanting something super special, Come over here on night one to make sure you get it because we are at sea. When something runs out, it's gone. Well, not forever, but forever for your cruise. So definitely come over here, grab it, take it to your cabin, and then you will have whatever you're looking for and you won't miss it. Right across from the shop, you will find Solera Beauty. Here you're gonna find your makeup, your perfume, all of this stuff to make you feel super pretty. So come over here, check it out, and grab something. Why not? So we are getting closer and closer to the end of deck five because this fun never stops. And it never stops at the Spotlight Karaoke Lounge. I really like the new layout of this lounge. This can be found on other Oasis class ships, but I like how they've switched it up and just kind of rearranged it. I think this is a much better layout. And check this out. There are actual private karaoke booths private like you can actually rent these booths with snacks and drinks and they have bottle service i mean that's really cool grab a bunch of your friends while you're on a cruise come over here and sing so fun what a fun activity to do on a sea day directly across from the spotlight karaoke lounge you will find boleros this is going to be your latin club on board come over here and salsa merengue dance it up enjoy the live music it's a really really cool place to come and hang out in between boleros and spotlight karaoke you will find this this guy, this guy doesn't need any introduction. This is Starbucks. Come over here, grab your latte, your frappuccino, your cappuccino, whatever it takes to get you going in the morning, come over here and grab it. They're ready for you. Phew, that was a lot on deck five. So many things, but the fun does not stop on deck five because we have now made it to the front of the ship and here you will find the Royal Theater. It's going to be where you will see all of your production shows. You gotta check your app for all of the times, everything that's going on. I feel like there's something going on all the time. So definitely don't miss it. You don't want to miss any of the performances that they have in here. It's so great. Now there are two entrances to the Royal Theater. There's one on deck five and there's one on deck four. So you can go in either one. Pretty cool. We are now on deck four. We are at the front of the ship now. And here you will find the other entrance to the Royal Theater. Remember on deck five, I said there's one on deck five and deck four. That's where we are right now. Come over here, check out all of your performances. Make sure you don't miss anything. Now a tip from us, make sure you book your reservations as soon as you can. Like seriously, as soon as you can connect to the ship's Wi-Fi, go ahead and make those reservations because there are a lot of people on Oasis class ships. You don't want to miss something. Check that out. Do not forget to make your reservations. Right past the Royal Theater on deck four, you will find the Golden Room. This is going to be a special casino for all the Diamond, Pinnacle. All of you guys can come in here and enjoy. This is a really neat space and I like that it's private and small and intimate. I love that. And right next to the Golden Room, you will find the Diamond Lounge. This is going to be your lounge area for all of the Diamond, Pinnacle. All of you guys can come over here and enjoy as well. I mean, you have your own little casino, your own little lounge, What's not to love? Moving 
right along on deck four, you will find the Attic Comedy Club. This is where you're gonna see all of your comedians on board. Come over here, grab a cocktail, and laugh until it hurts. Right past the Attic Comedy Club, you will find Studio B. This is going to be the ice rink on board. I did say ice rink. You heard that correctly. Ice skating on board. They have a fantastic ice show here. Don't miss that. Remember, you might need to make reservations, so check your app. They also have open ice skating. Also, check your app for that, where you can actually ice skate. Why not? You're on a ship. You can ice skate on a ship. Who can say that? Moving right along on deck four, you will find the Casino Royale. You know what to do in here. Bells, whistles, win it big. Moving right along on deck four, you will find Aizumi. This is going to be your hibachi and sushi restaurant on board. Come over here, we love hibachi food. Check it out, make sure you make a reservation. Do not miss this restaurant. We have made it to the end of deck four and here you'll find another entrance to the main dining room. Remember there are three entrances. There's one on five, four, and three. And come over here, enjoy your breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It's complimentary, enjoy it all. Well, there you go guys. That's Wonder of the Seas, the whole thing from top to bottom. What'd you think? <laughs> Is your mind blown like mine? It's going to be an amazing week on this ship. I cannot wait. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of the fun coming at you day one through, I don't know how many days we're on the ship, a long time. It's gonna be so fun and to enjoy. I can't wait to bring you everything, all the shows, all the food. All the food? All the food. <laughs> it's gonna be a great week, guys. Thanks so much for watching, bye. This is very difficult. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Amongst all of the seating, oh! <laughs> Stay. There are so many. <coughs> I think I swallowed a bug. <coughs> I swallowed a bug. And you will find. <laughs> la, 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 la. Grab yourself a putter, grab yourself a ball, and I don't know, what do you do with, with golf? <laughs> I forget. Do you score goals? Put it in the hole? <laughs> Go for a hole in one. That's what it is. Oh, but it made no sense. <laughs> Starting again. Right past that first set of pools. Right, we. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so windy. <laughs> We are now on deck 14 at the front of the ship, I think. You should check that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and then check this out. This are these. <laughs> I got it. Yes. We are now on deck 10 at the front of the ship. And now deck. <laughs> we are now on deck 10 and deck the front of the ship. But we are in Central Park. <laughs> This is a complimentary eating option on Wonder. Which are we on? Finishing off our Central Park tour, you will find these high-end shopping stores. Say shopping stores? Is that redundant? <laughs> you'll find these. <laughs> so you can come over here, get your jewelry, probably handbags. I don't know, jewelry. Starting this deck off, you will find the Vitality Spa at Sea. Close. Oh, so close. We start at deck six at the spa, the Vite. There's kind of a little space in the middle where it's the Royal, Royal Promenade? Royal Promenade. Right behind the shore excursion iPads, you will find the photo gallery. It's called something. Get it together, Steph. You are not, get your app out. It's actually called photo gallery. I thought it had a name. Well, I had it right the first time. <clears throat> right across from the kids. Right across from the kids shop. The first entrance to your main dining room. Here you have. <laughs> I had to check the map. <laughs> On deck five, you will find the first entrance to the main dining. You will find. So we are now on deck five, and at the, and, 
I'll get it. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Come and get all of your feel. Come and eat all of it. Come and enjoy all of the. Right past the bionic bar, you will find an, an in. Right past the bionic bar, you will find an entrance. I forgot what it was called. <laughs> right past the bionic bar, you will find an entrance to the rising tide. Rising tide bar. <laughs> this is. What a way to start your morning with a cup. Why am I whispering? Why am I whispering? Sometimes I feel like I've already started and I have no words. <clears throat> and the first thing you will find here on the Royal Perm. Bionic bar. Here you can have an abrupta pop. Hi. I get it. They also have mocktails here. So if you have directly across from the cafe promenade, you will find regalia. You will find regalia. Is it regalia? Regalia? I don't know. It's such. This is going to be your pint. Your pint. Come over here, grab a pint. <laughs> now they're on a real on a now this space is actually on a this is going to be your Latin in the middle between boleros and this is a, what is that called? Spotlight Spotlight karaoke. I love that there are two entrances, makes it makes literally laugh until it hurts. Why not? <laughs> Look, I'm already in the comedy club. <laughs> Making my own jokes. Sometimes I just want to sing the music. Free fallen. Back to this tour. We have come to the end of deck four. It's like, whoop, whoop. It's like so perfect. Remember there's This is going to be your hibachi and sushi. It's on the wall. <laughs> it's literally on the wall. This is going to be your hibachi and sushi. I have the hardest time saying sushi. <laughs> sushi. Oh my gosh, guys, what do you think of this ship? It's beautiful. What an amazing, oh, no, sorry. Starting in. This is where I belong. I belong in the kids club.